Hi Andy, these are the colors you ordered. We want to demonstrate with these colors how shiny our pigments are and why they might no sparkle. Please watch this video until the end. We hope we can change your mind. I'm using a special sticker to better showcase these watches. Applying our gel primer from Karusha Cosmetics, you need just tiny tiny amount so that the glitter shows its true color and adheres well. I'm applying the first shade number 14. We speed up this video to keep it from dragging on. I will be applying each color one by one. And next shade, this is 24. By the way, the darker and thinner the pigment, the less it may shine. That's why we showcase lighter shades in our advertisement. But they are still very sparkling. I added a bit more primer to my hand because this is important not to let it dry completely. The glitter needs to adhere to the eyelids or to my hand. There should be a thin translucent layer for perfect application. I check with my finger to ensure there's no too much gel. If there's too much gel primer, the glitter may crease on the eyelids. Now let's compare the difference in shimmer. First of all, take a look at how beautiful glitter shine in the sunlight. And now let's explore why they might not be shining. It's all about the light. Any glitter shine because of the refraction of light. If there isn't good lighting in the room, there won't be any sparkle. And you don't necessarily need professional lighting for this. Please try looking at your makeup under different lighting conditions. And the last thing we want to show you how long lasting our products are thanks to the gel primer. It's a very economical product and it will last you for many years. I say this as a professional makeup teacher with 10 years of experience. And here is my hand after the water. Look, everything stays perfectly.